Today, we are going to talk about a paper on plant root segmentation using encoder-decoder neural networks. The author's goal is to propose a multi-resolution architecture-based encoder-decoder neural network to address the problem of reliably segmenting plant root structure from soil in X-ray CT images. The first paper gives us an idea of the stacked hourglass architecture from which the author's method is based on, while the other two are different methods from which the author draws comparison. Give them a read when you have some time. The figure shows the proposed architecture. What's unique is that the input is of 3D volume rather than a 2D image. The network consists of two paths. The upper named the downsampled path uses a 128 cube input size and extracts features at a coarse resolution. The lower path is named the native path accepts a 16 cube input size and produces finer segmentation detail using native resolution of the volume. During training, the loss, that is the difference between the predicted and actual values, called binary cross-entropy loss, is calculated and fed to an algorithm called stochastic gradient descent to change the parameters of the network. The input dataset consists of 47 volumetric images of intact wheat roots in soil captured using a CT scanner. The metrics related to true negative success, that is, classification of soil is not considered as they are always close to one and less helpful. The selected metrics are shown here. Precision is the ratio of correct root predictions to the total number of roots predicted. Recall is the ratio of correct root predictions to the total number of root predictions that were needed in the actual case. The F1 score gives an overall model performance by taking both precision and recall into account. The Jacquard index is also used to measure the overlap between the prediction and ground truth. Scores closer to 1 for both F1 and Jacquard index indicate better segmentation performance. The model is also compared to other architectures as shown.